Hey everyone, it's Nicole. Welcome to today's plan with me. Today I'm going to be doing a plan as I go style video and I'm using this gorgeous Easter kit by Little Miss Paper We. We are going to be planning for the week of Easter this week, which is April 10th through the 16th. Getting right on into it, I'm starting off as usual and just putting down the bottom washi. With the Little Miss Papery kits, you get um, a thicker strip of washi and then two thinner strips. And one of the strips uh, was very similar in print to the larger strip, so I put that pink one down, that really thin pink one down in between them just to kind of create some sort of separation and divide. Um, while I do that, I'm going to kind of talk about a little bit how I planned this week. This week I pretty much planned the night before. I usually when I do plan as I goes I sit down like two or three times a week and kind of like memory plan the previous days so this time around I did go ahead and sit down the night before and plan at the end of the week I did I think I memory planned Thursday and then I just pre-planned the rest of the weekend since I pretty much knew what my plans were going to be Next, I'm just jumping into my sidebar and I took the quote box that said somebody loves you and the floral print there and then I chose the very, very light kind of like lavender purple glitter header and use that as my separation throughout my sidebar. Then I just put down the habit tracker and a, another glitter header and then I went in with a this week header to mark my work week. I put a pink ombre box underneath an ombre heart checklist, uh, but I meant to put a weekly box so I end up just pulling that up um, and switching that down to the next section um, on top of a ombre weekly box and then I put a to buy header on top of the pink ombre heart checklist. Once I got that all situated, I moved up to the top of the page and I put the glitter flag that came with the kit to cover up the Erin Condren flags. And then I went ahead with the more subtle date covers. You do get two options with the Little Miss Papery kits. The ones that I chose just had a little bit less greenery in them. Um, I did want to keep it a little bit more subdued up there. Moving on to Monday, I put down a green glitter header and a yellow ombre heart checklist because I had a bunch of things I wanted to get done when I got into work in the morning. And then I put down this kind of like beigey yellow glitter header, very pale and a full box. And then I put down the pink glitter header for my today section. Under the pink glitter header, I did put down just a very pale pink today header and I put a couple of little tiny circle stickers that came with the kit, kind of like as bullet points. I had an interview in the morning and then I had a lunch meeting, so I put those down to mark that. I did put a little thing down to mark my dinner, which I don't ever really do, but my sister had brought home this really delicious balsamic vinegar from Italy, and my mom is going to make chicken cutlets and have mozzarella and everything for us to um, have with it, so I wanted to mark that. And then underneath the little thing, I put just a little television that came with the kit to mark a show that I had wanted to watch. I put down my glitter headers for Tuesday and then just a couple of icons that came with the kit on the sidebar and in the today section of Monday. And then on to Tuesday, I did put down a full box and a checklist since I pretty much knew the tasks I had to get done for Tuesday as well on Sunday. Uh, and then moving on to Tuesday, I put a cell phone icon down to mark a call that I had to make. And then I put a laptop down because I had to get on the phone with our IT guy to sort out some issues. And then just put a green quarter box that came with the kit along with a little asterisk that came with the kit as well to mark some reports that I had to run. And then I put down a half box with the little Happy Mail sticker that came with the kit. Not to mark Happy Mail, but a letter that I had to draft for one of my employees. And then I went ahead and again put down my headers for Wednesday along with the full box and ombre heart checklist. And then I wanted to stop for coffee on the way into work, so I put down the coffee cup that came with the kit. Under that, I put down a quarter box to mark an interview that I had and then a kind of half-sized sticker in solid yellow to mark the viewing of the space that one of my departments is moving into next week. And then down there on the full box, I put down a shopping cart for some door handles that I had to purchase. And then after that, my boyfriend and I were going to have a little date night. So I put the date night sticker that came with the kit along with a foiled icon from Planning World. 
I then went back to Monday and just added a Clever Gal Crafts gold foiled flag because my house went under contract, which is a good thing and yet sad all at the same time. But I just wanted to kind of memory plan that, so I did put that down. And then moving to the end of the week, I put down my date covers along with the other glitter flag that came for the top of the Erin Condren. On Thursday, I started off with a full box and a green glitter header at the top of the page. After that, I just went ahead and added the other two glitter headers for Thursday. And then I added a ombre heart checklist to the end of the day. I went ahead and filled in my to-dos and then moving to the today section, I put down a little thing with an exclamation point for just an appointment that I had for the admin space. The HVAC people were coming to fix a couple of things that were wrong with the ductwork. And then I had to wait for a delivery at my boss's house, so I just put another little gold foiled icon from Planning World. At this point, I kind of went ahead and just pre-planned the rest of my week. For Friday, I put down all of my glitter headers, and you'll notice the rest of the week I really don't use any checklists because I didn't really need them. On Friday, I started out with a light pink kind of quarterback size sticker from the kit along with a little asterisk to mark the um, moving of the copy machine from one office to the other. And then I put down a Clever Golf Crafts foiled flag and a little heart that came with the kit to mark lunch. And underneath that, when I got home, I put down a little laptop because I just did a little bit of YouTube binge watching. And then I painted my nails, which I noted in the Me Time sticker. That little nail polish bottle is from Planning Roses. And underneath that, I put down the movie marquee. My boyfriend and I ended up watching the show First States, which is actually kind of cute, uh, but we kind of just had an early night. And then on the full box, I did just put the payday sticker down that came with the kit because it was a payday for me. I wanted to put the weekend banner down so I figured out where I wanted my full boxes for the weekend so I can strategically place my weekend banner down. It kind of messed up my header placement because I ended up with like two greens next to each other and two pinks next to each other um, but I think I end up moving them around a little bit later on but I did put those down and then I started planning for Saturday. On Saturday, I had planned to get up early and just get a lot of stuff done. So I put down the circular daily chore sticker to note that I wanted to tidy up my room. And then that usually leads to a lot of laundry. So I put down the laundry day sticker that came with the kit as well. And then I just grabbed a little thing because I had to run to the grocery store for some items for Easter Sunday. I popped down a little exclamation point on the full box because I had to get my voiceover done for this video and then moving down to the last section of the day, I put down a little things sticker along with the little shopping bag that came with the kit. I had a Kohl's coupon that expired that day and I wanted to go ahead and see if I could pick up some things for the spring and summer, especially clothing that I could wear to work. And then finally I put down a half box to note a birthday celebration that I had, um, one of our our friends was turning 30 so I put that down along with the balloons that came with the kit as well. Then I went ahead and put a Janelle sticker down from the Fox and Pip. She's just holding an iced coffee because I wanted to stop and get coffee in the morning before I went to my cousin's. We were having a children and adult Easter egg hunt at my cousin's house. So I put down a half box and then that family time sticker. And then I was going out to dinner later on with my godparents. So I put a green quarter box down to mark that dinner. And then, I'm sorry it got cut off, but I did put a little things down uh, and a little Spencer and Jude play button for my video which obviously did not go up on Sunday it's going up a little bit late then I went back to Saturday and just took up that one little thing and replaced it with another because I didn't end up going to the grocery store but I did make it to the gym so I put that little thing down and put a Crafts by Towie sneaker sticker on top of that and then I went in with some deco and just finished everything up and pulled it all together. I'm sorry I didn't get my video up this past Sunday. I know it's an Easter spread and Easter is over but I wanted to get this up anyway because I really really enjoyed using this kit. I think the colors are beautiful. I love Little Miss Papery kits. You get so much to work with. See in a second I'll take you through everything that I have left but definitely enough to get me through another spread at least just a heavy heavy white space spread so yeah again I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you all in my next one bye, -bye.